and she was just standing there watching me and I remember looking up and just seeing her and just going wow she's beautiful I knew I was in deep I you know I had fallen for the girl the last thing I wanted to do was hurt her I took on a, a regular babysitting gig. She was five. Uh, she was a precocious girl. She was advanced for her age. She was also very independent. A lot of my fantasies actually revolve around little girls who are in some way more powerful than I am. Eventually my attraction became you know, overwhelming to the point I had to go relieve myself in the bathroom. That's when I had to leave town and get my head straightened out. I didn't abuse her because I knew the harm that it could cause. Also, you know, remembering the fact that I was abused, it probably contributed to my own sexuality developing. I have never sexually abused a child and I never will. Now, I've gotten to know a lot of pedophiles online. My sense is that we're a much larger group than society actually thinks we are. The terms uh, pedophile and child molester are used interchangeably. This is wrong. A pedophile is, strictly speaking, somebody who has a sexual attraction to children. It's important to realize that not all pedophiles are child molesters and not all child molesters are pedophiles. When I first told all of my family, they had a hard time dealing with it. They had a hard time reconciling what they knew about me versus the you know what they thought they knew about pedophiles. I went through a, a severe bout of depression and, and social anxiety that lasted a few years. A lot of that was basically me coming to realize that I wasn't going to have a family, I wasn't going to fall in love with a woman and have a normal life. I'm resigned to the fact that uh, you know I'm basically going to spend the rest of my life alone. This is not something I chose. What person in their right mind would choose to be the most reviled sexuality in the world? My purpose is basically to go out and educate people, allowing people like myself to uh, to express themselves, to, to come out and uh, be open. Society makes it harder by persecuting us because a lot of us become fatalistic. We just start to think it doesn't matter what we do or say, they're going to hate us anyway. We need to find some kind of middle ground where society and pedophiles can come together. We love kids, we want to protect them too, you know, and we're on society's side on that.